The thought of going through spinal surgery is terrifying for most people, but a new robotics procedure is changing the invasive operation. News Channel 9's Sandra Ramirez is live in our news center to explain. Sandra. It's called the Maser Robotics Renaissance System, and this new state-of-the-art technology means surgeons are spending less time in the operating room, and spinal surgery patients are getting back on their feet a whole lot sooner. We spoke with the only local doctor using this procedure in El Paso, and a patient who says he'd recommend it to anyone. Manny Castaneda is a dancing man. We love to dance. So when he started having back pain that made it difficult to walk or even stand, he knew he had to do something about it. The, at first, it was not that bad. It was a pain that was there, but then it went down my legs and I couldn't walk, and then I got a hard time doing anything. After seeing a handful of doctors and trying prescription medications and steroid injections, he finally met Dr. Martin. That's the best thing that ever happened to me. And, uh, no more pain. Dr. Martin has been in El Paso for four years and has been using the Maser Robotics Renaissance System since August. It's a robotic guidance that assists the surgeons in placing screws in the spine. There are only 18 locations in the entire United States that offer the Maser Robotics Renaissance System, and that includes one right here in El Paso. Dr. George Martin says although many people are hesitant to get spinal surgery, he wants them to know that this is the cutting edge of technology. This basically is the most advanced technology in spinal surgery today. The procedure involves placing the patient's CT scans into a computer program that creates a virtual three-dimensional plan that guides the surgeon on where to place the screws. In the operating room, we break, place the robot onto the patient's spine with a, a secure mounting device. With the new robotic system, the incisions are smaller, there's less tissue damage and less blood loss, which means patients are back on their feet two to four weeks sooner than if they had traditional surgery. I feel great. I feel marvelous. And for Manny, that means hitting the dance floor with his wife. Now, Dr. Martin has performed about 50 surgeries since launching the robotic system last year, and he says they've all been a success. He also tells us the robotics procedure is covered by most insurance companies. Reporting live from our local news center, Sandra Damides, News Channel 9. All right, thank you for that report, Sandra.